Janet Jackson was singing her heart out last night for a very special cause. Proceeds from her two Radio City Music Hall concerts have been poured into an airlift of food and medical supplies for Rwandan refugees. I was watching CNN and this little kid, he was like three years old, he was walking down the street all by himself and they said that um, his parents were killed. And it really, really got to me and that's when I said, I'm sorry, something has to be done. At a party after the show, Janet asked fans to dish out donations for the airlift while we asked her to dish the dirt about her brother Michael. Was it true that he and Lisa Marie Presley had really tied the knot, as reported in the tabloids two weeks ago? I don't know either. I'm just like the rest of you guys. I, I don't know. I haven't spoken to him yet. We talked before all of that just happened, and so I don't know if it's true or not. The accountants are still totaling up how much Janet Jackson's concerts have raised for Rwandan refugees. The relief agency hopes to turn the cash into food and medicine by as early as two. Relief concert. Enjoy that. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. I'm Ted Koppel. Later on Nightline, the critics call it Whitewater Gate. The president's allies call it Wastewater. Somewhere lies the truth, but will Congress find it tonight? Yeah.